All right, here's my review on this thing. I went ahead and got one and uh, figured I'd try it out. I had two of the older ones and they were hit and miss. Uh, they worked or they didn't. Uh, this one has a few upgrades on it. Like the battery's better, uh, the fact that you can use a regular tip housing and tips, a little good. Uh, so, busted this out yesterday, had a little tiny fence to spray, uh, or to paint, um, and I was like, ah, let's bust this out and uh, try it out. So, I start spraying with it, it's about 80 degrees, I uh, get about one little section of the fence done, um, before, about into the second court. Uh, that I, I feel this is about a quart, right? I don't know. So, and then it just cut out on me, and I was like, ah, oh, that's fucking not a very long battery life. So, took the battery out, put the new one in, started going, and it uh, cut out within about th three or four seconds. And I was like, okay, it can't be right. Both these batteries are fully charged. So, what happens is it overheats uh, very quickly and it shuts off. So, that's problematic. Uh, so I see people on uh, Instagram and YouTube and stuff they're spraying full garage doors and stuff and then I see they stop before the garage doors done and it's like okay that's because you only have a quart you can't spray a whole garage door with just a quart of paint I see people using this I mean this is all you have and then, I mean good good for you use it um, but the fact that it kept cutting out uh, okay so what I would use this for I'm gonna keep it keep it in the truck if I have a single door front door to paint, if I have a double door, a quart isn't going to cut it. And I'm not going to stop, reload my quart, and have my, the, the chances of the, fl the door flashing. So if I have one front door to paint, brilliant. Uh, other than that, uh, it's kind of senseless I mean and, and the, the time it took to take all these parts out and clean it I could have cleaned my my regular paint sprayer in, in a faster time because you have to take a little wire brush and kind of clean everything out and also my concerns when I talked about this before was this little thing and I don't know if you can see it but it's already broken out of one day of use so now I have to pay attention to this little cap every time so yeah like I said I'm gonna keep this in the truck and I'm gonna use it for a single front door that's it other than that it's uh it's gonna overheat kind of useless I mean so a $400 front door gun there you go it's my honest review on that uh, eh. Take it or leave it. The right painter. Yee.